Hello everyone and welcome to this video of this 2012 Motor Guzzi V12 Sport. A lovely, lovely bike this is. Two owners from new, just over 22,000 miles covered. Very good service history and stunning condition. Um, a lot of people will be asking or wondering about the dreaded camshaft followers. This has been done on this machine. We've got proof of this. Um, it's also had a clock change. Again, this has been documented properly. So a real genuine, lovely bike. It's got its full document pack um, with lots of invoices for maintenance and parts and stuff. Got the Hepco and Becker panniers fitted. It's got some Oxford heated grips as well. Apart from that, very unmolested machine. So we'll go ahead and uh, show you the condition. Starting at the front, no stone chipping to report here. Lovely and clean bike. Tiny little nick there, but just being super critical. Another one down there on the mud guard, but really, you can see one there. These are sort of like pinhead size stone chips and so nothing to really worry about. Um, front of the engine, lovely and clean. You got some little bit of tarnishing just on the oil pipe there. Very minor, nothing to, to worry about. And then the front wheel, fork legs, finish is all original, lovely and clean. The wheels, I can't find any blistering on the wheels. And all the, the bolts, the fasteners, all lovely and original. Um, no real tarnishing to mention. So exhaust down pipes, again, no surface corrosion, beautiful condition. You can see down low, right underneath the bike, all nice and clean. All the engine paint is intact as well. Again, no blistering um, of that finish. You can see, all this area, lovely and clean too. Final drive unit, all lovely and clean. No deterioration to the finish. Rear wheels just as good as the front. Original finish that is. Right-hand pannier, very much unmarked, nice and clean. And we go around the back of the bike. Show you the left hand pannier. You got some light storage marks here, if you can see them. Very minor. I don't think that'll put anybody off. And then the exhaust, little nick there, but only a nick. The rest of it's lovely. Original exhaust, and that rear wheel from this side. Just another angle. Rear, rear shock, it's a bit dark in there, so it's quite hard to see, but it is lovely and clean, I can assure you. And well, this left-hand side is just as good as the other that I went through earlier. Nothing to point out. Then going to the front wheel again, on the left side, you can see no, no blistering or peeling of the paint. Lovely and clean again. Exhaust down pipes. Just another angle here of the front of the engine. Um, nothing to report on the fuel tank either. Just that little, what looks like a stone chip, about the size of a pinhead. Very minor. Top of the bike, this um, seat cowl. There is a mark just over there. About an inch long. Again, we like to point these things out, but they are very minor. And you've got these lovely seats. I love riding these bikes, they're so comfortable. Real deep dished seat, well padded. And then the top of the bike, again, all lovely. No damage. And then you've got your controls. Cockpit. And I'm sure 
you'll agree that this is a lovely example. Well, if that's of interest, please do give us a call. Our telephone number is 01202 479125. You can email me, paul at motorbiking.co.uk. If you've got a part exchange, whether it's of greater value or not, do let us know. We're we'll always interested in something nice and clean just like this. Um, we've got finest calculators on the website. Click the advert, scroll to the bottom of the page, and you'll find that calculator. If you want to visit www.motorbiking.co.uk. Well, I hope this video has helped, and thank you for watching.